the deletion of table 39 basically means that in, in many cases, uh, the contractor is now going to have to install a cable uh, coming into the house, the main service coming into the house, that's actually one size larger than it was previously. Uh, so, so that is a pretty big impact because that, that size of cable, of course, is a very common size uh, for odd cable. So, so now if they got to go one size larger, uh, you know, there, there will be a bit of cost involved there. So that's probably the biggest one. Um, section 22 on corrosive and wet locations, uh, big, big changes in corrosive uh, uh, atmospheres. So this applies to barns. Uh, for livestock and horses as, as well. And uh, uh, we've really beefed up the requirements uh, for the wiring methods in, in wet locations, uh, sorry, in corrosive and wet locations. And these were a result of a lot of barn fires that happened in Ontario. Uh, and what we found is, and, and I say we, because I'm actually on the section 22 subcommittee, uh, what we found was the electrical equipment was breaking down over time not because of poor wiring methods, but because of a significant amount of corrosion in the air. Uh, and that happens as a result of the animal byproduct. So we've really, we've really stepped it up as far as the wiring methods go. Now all your receptacles and switches uh, need a weatherproof type cover uh, on them in, in a barn application. Uh, 